Hey everybody, this is Brandon Brittingham from the Maryland and Delaware Group of Law and & Foster and today we're talking about investing in real estate. So last time we talked about cash flow. So one of the great things about real estate also is the ability to use it as leverage. So what do we mean by that? So typically if you had $100,000, you bought one asset, you've invested $100,000 in one asset, you know, stocks, things of that nature. With real estate, the one thing you can do is you can take $20,000, put a down payment on five homes because of leverage because banks will, will let you leverage because they use the real estate as collateral. So you can take $20,000 and put it down on a $100,000 home. If you did that five times, that same $100,000 that you have gave you the leverage to own five houses. So the great thing about that is you get five times the cash flow and the appreciation. So one of the great things that people that have created wealth and built wealth have figured out is the ability to use real estate as a leverage vehicle. So you can have less money, but you can own a, ve a much more expensive property. And as we've talked about in, in the last video, if you buy it based on cash flow, then you have five times the amount of cash flow. So one of the great things about real estate is leverage. And a lot of people who have built wealth and become millionaires off of, of real estate know and understand this pr principle. So one of the things that people use real estate for from an investment standpoint is leverage. And then as this builds, you have the ability to use the equity in those properties to leverage to buy more properties, which is something that I've done plenty of times. And for me personally, where I'm at a situation where I'm close to 400 rentals now, I've used this over and over again. I've taken leverage to buy more property to build a larger and larger asset portfolio. So it's a great way long-term to build wealth and it's a great way long-term to use leverage to grow your net worth. So we're going to continue to talk about how you can use real estate to help build wealth. But this is one of the secrets when it comes to using real estate to build wealth is the idea of leverage.